guys, the name of the recording uh, label is AJM Records, and it was originally started for Cuban music, but when the founder and creator Mario Baeza found Ashanti, things changed. Now AJM is a family affair, and it's in the spotlight for releasing Ashanti's never-before-heard recordings, and one of the producers behind the album is Mario's 15-year-old son, Miguel Migs Baeza. Move over, Pharrell. There's a new producer in town. Miguel Migs Baeza just wrapped up tracks on Ashanti's upcoming album, and he's only 15 years old. 15 years old. Mm -hmm. When did you first start producing? Uh, I started producing when I was 13. Okay. You know, I started on the Phantom and really getting on a keyboard. The in-house producer, Kid Cold, taught me how to work all of this stuff. I'd definitely say my dad taught me on the piano. His dad, Mario Baeza, is the creator and owner of AJM Records. Baeza found Ashanti and brought her to Irv Gotti, creating a joint venture with Def Jam Murder, Inc. Records. Although he sold his interest to Universal Records, he kept control of Ashanti's masters and is releasing them in The Vault. Miguel produced two tracks on the album. It's, it's every father's dream, right, to have, have, in this case, my son really pick up the baton and run with it, and, and he's done it beautifully. Baeza says music was always in his son's blood. We have him with footage at three years old, you know, writing compositions on the piano. All three children, myself, we had a band for a number of years we played. But producing isn't his only passion. Miguel is also a star on the soccer field, is getting ready to become an Eagle Scout, and would love to attend his mother's alma mater, Princeton. His next challenge, producing for up-and-coming artist Erica DeLuna. He's extremely talented. He's a problem now for the industry, and I mean that in a good way. So in a few years, I'm really afraid to see what he can be. It's going to be good. What artist would you like to work with one day? Uh, Lil Wayne. Really? <laughs> Little Why Wayne, I love. I listened to his music all from the beginning. Of course, I love Jay Z, Nas, Busta Rhymes. Let's see if he can teach me a thing or two. And here's the hook you're listening to now, but on the bridge, I think I'm going to add some instruments. All right, let's add some parts. This is the Phantom. This is where we get all our sounds from. We're going to add violins to the uh, to the bridge, so to lead into the hook. And then after we recorded it, we'd come back here and then mix it. And the name of the album, again, is The Vault. It hits stores today, so be sure to check it out. For more information on AJM Records, log on to our website, cw11.com slash morning news. The news at 7 starts right now. John. Good morning. I'm John Muller. Stocks on Wall Street and markets around the world do some major rebounding. What